What's up y'all, this is Scooter from Electric here in Northern California with the Hyundai Ioniq 5N. We're gonna take this to the world famous Laguna Seca racetrack, open it up and see what this performance EV is all about. Come with me. The Hyundai Ioniq 5N is an all electric track focus variant of the passenger Ioniq 5. I have personally always been a big fan of. This version is the first all-electric model from Hyundai's N performance arm, described by the brand as the technology powerhouse of Hyundai. First off, you'll notice several upgrades to the N variant compared to the standard Ionic 5, although both remain street legal. Oh, and it has a rear wiper. Well done, Hyundai. It's about time. We've been waiting to get behind the wheel of this one since it was first announced back in 2022. For starters, the Ionic 5N is longer, wider, and lower than its standard counterpart. Up front, you'll see an N-specific bumper and grille with active air flaps and a unique orange strip that goes around the entire vehicle. The side profile features wider wheel arches and 21-inch forged wheels equipped with wider Pirelli P0 tires designed specifically for this EV. The rear features a unique spoiler, lower air diffusers, checkered flag inspired reflectors, and of course, a special end badge. Inside the EV is a similar layout to the standard Ionic 5, but with several sportier elements. This includes sport bucket seats, metal pedals that support left foot braking, a sturdier center console, and a special steering wheel complete with four end specific buttons to shift gears, as well as paddles behind to shift when in end pedal mode. Here's me hopping in the 5N for the first time and cruising around on the street before hitting the track at Laguna Seca. My reaction hearing this simulated engine noise for the first time is genuine. <laughs> One of the most interesting elements in the Hyundai Ionic 5N is Active Sound Plus, offering four unique sounds based on real Hyundai engines, concept vehicles, and even fighter jet noises. On the performance side, Hyundai N is up the size and energy density of the performance variant's battery pack from 77.4 kilowatt hours to 84 kilowatt hours, significantly bolstering its output from 277 kilowatts to 535 kilowatts in the 5N. Once I got a feel for this racetrack ready EV, it was time to take it out for some laps around Laguna Seca. Being an EV guy, I'm admittedly not the most seasoned driver on racetracks and was sort of intimidated by Laguna Seca, a track I had only driven in Gran Turismo as a kid up until this point. However, after my first three laps, I really got the hang of it and absolutely loved how easy the Ionic 5 n made the track, even the corkscrew, for an amateur like myself. Cruising around the famous track in Monterey, I could really feel the torsion strength in the Ionic 5 n the N's dual motors combine for 601 horsepower or 641 horsepower with grid boost activated and 545 foot-pounds of torque. Another cool factor was the N grid boost, which gave me a 10 second increase to that full 641 horsepower in straightaways. It was almost like hitting a cheat code or a NOS button or something. All right, enough talk. I really want you to take a moment to listen to the Hyundai Ioniq 5N on the Laguna Seca track so you can really get a feel for that active sound. Don't judge me, I'm not a professional driver. Because the N team is delivering a lot more power in this version of the Ionic 5, there is a sacrifice of range, 221 miles. Not ideal for road trips, but then again, this car still charges very quickly and get that versatility of being able to tear it up on the track as well as just driving around. Now that I've driven it and taken it on the track, I genuinely love this car. I like the noises, I really do, but I do love that you can turn them off. I see a future in electric motorsport here, and I think this car is starting to bridge that gap. And I can see racing enthusiasts really getting behind this vehicle and, and enjoying driving it. I also really like that Hyundai is just selling this as a single all-in package. You get tons of the perks and charging speeds of the standard Ionic 5N with a whole bunch of upgrades. All for a starting MSRP of 66100 not including taxes or delivery fees. Whew. Holy smokes, that was one of the most fun things I've ever done in my life. 
This is Scooter Down from Electric signing off.